Hello everybody, this is Rishi Brandon Stafford with ExpeditiousFool.com, putting mindfulness in motion, also founder of Fellowship of Universal Truth Yogic Ministries. And today I have another channeled message for spirit, so let me get out of the way. So you are not your body and you are not your mind, period. And for a lot of people, that's the end game in their religious or spiritual practice. That's, that's what they're striving for, is to gain that understanding. Here's the trick of it though. Until you realize that you're not the body and you're not the mind, you have no true spiritual understanding. You have no true spiritual faith. It's just not possible. The reason being is because it will still be all transactional. In your world, there will still be good and bad based off of your perception. There will still be this and that. This group, that group. This person was mean to me. There will be that, be, still be that me, that I. There will still be those desires. There will still be your will. Because you haven't given in to what you're actually made for yet. You're made to serve the whole. That's it. And why? Because the whole is who you actually are. You're not a separate entity. So then it's not a bowing down. It's not a surrendering of yourself as in, you know, you have to give something away and be lower than. No, you have to step up and rise to the challenge and be accountable for what you are. You are all, so you must take care of all. This type of understanding, yeah, you might hear it up here, but this type of understanding can only sink in here when you realize that you're not the body and you're not the mind. This is the reason why sages of all time have given you techniques and practices and all kinds of things that lead you to one understanding. And yeah, different techniques for different people, but they lead you to one understanding. You're not the body, you're not the mind. Now you can get to work at truly understanding what it's all about, at understanding the spiritual game, at understanding God, at understanding yourself and who you truly are. All right, everybody. I wish nothing but the best for everyone that they come to this understanding. I hope this message helps. Have a great day on purpose and stay mindful. Namaskara.